Sorry, I got cut off there. So in the previous video, we were just going over how to launch Octobot on the cloud. So I got to the payment method on PayPal, which is connected to my digital ocean account. Uh, so if you didn't see that, just go back and watch part one. So I'm going to go and say add a credit or there we go. And that is a MasterCard, I believe, card number. Don't worry, this is a virtual card that I am adding in here. So you can go and do whatever you want with these details. They are not going to work on your side, which is the reason that I'm using them for this video. Ah, oh, there we go. You're even going to see my CVV number. Cool, and let's go and put in, sure, why not? That's fine. Save. All set. Da, 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 da. They're going to pay, make this sure. All rightio. Okay. So now that my digital ocean is all set up and paid for, there we go. Processing. It's going to take me back to digital ocean. Cool. 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 Okay. Welcome to digital ocean. Let's get started. So now I have my account. I have my username. I have my details. I have all of that. So what I'm going to do is go back to this and say, deploy on digital ocean. I'm already signed in. So it's just going to open up another tab. And it's going to be as simple as that. It's a web service. I'm going to go, I don't know what any of this is. Um, that is going to be my URL that it is pulling from. So it says uh, GitHub, uh, Dracker Software, Octobot Master. So that is, it's going to GitHub. It's getting that code and it's going to deploy that online for me. So I'm going to go and hit next. Um, what do I want to call it? Okay, cool. I'm going to say it is my fancy trading bot. Let's see. No, nope, it won't even give me spaces. Cool. And where am I? I want to be, they don't have many options. So sure, why not be Bangalore next? And I am on the basic plan because that is what it says I need. And I'm going to reduce that down to $5 a month. I have established that that is enough to run the basic app. And I'm going to say launch basic app my fancy trading bot has been created and this is it okay it is building so now it's going to take roughly 10 minutes so i'm going to pause the video here and i'm going to restart it once it is almost done Just a quick check-in. So the bot is now at 17%. So I think I am, yeah, I'm about 10 minutes in at 17%. I do remember from the last time, it does take quite a while at 17% and then it shoots forward. So I'll check back in once it's done. All right, here we go. So 100% deployed successfully. So there is my app. My fancy bot, uh, J7, blah -de blah -de blah whatever. Let's just go click on that. And it should load straight into my Octobot. Accept and go to Octobot. Okay, cool. Um, just something to mention. You can check out the tutorial. That is a great idea to do for your first time. Uh, I'm just going to skip that. I would really recommend that you do go and check out the tutorial, absorb all the information that you can. Um, so this is going to be the, the end of the second video. I will pick up everything in the next